So hello, hello everyone. Hello, welcome, good night. So hello Juan, Soraya, Jorge, how are you? How are you? Hi, how are you tonight, Jorge? Good. Perfect. Very really good. <laughs> Perfect, that's very nice. And what about the rest? Juan, are you with us, Juan? No, not yet. Okay, so he's connecting. Soraya, Eric, Lisette, how are you? How are you, teacher? Hi, Soraya. I'm good, thank you. So, okay. Someone is... Mute. Okay, perfect. So, guys, if you can help me turning on your cameras, please. I want to see all of you, okay? So, hello, Lisette. How are you? Well, Lisette, I guess she's having some internet issues. So, well, for the rest that are joining, welcome, okay? Welcome for today's class. So, bienvenidos, chicos. Now, let me show you something before starting the class of tonight. Déjenme compartirles algo, chicos. Sorry, this one not. Esto no. Hello, teachers. Hi, hello. So, guys, um, welcome. Welcome, everybody. So, chicos, before to start, I want to ask you something. Did all finish lesson, well, lesson number two, section number two? Todos terminamos los ejercicios de la sección number one and two. Yes. Yes, yes. Alguien que no lo haya terminado, que diga no. No, no, terminado. Hello, guys. No one. Todos lo terminamos entonces. Yo. Ah, uh, ¿quién es yo? Sorry. Ah, uh, Lisette. So Lisette, you didn't finish. Yes. Uh, ¿Cuál te faltó, Lisette? Hello. Hello, Lisette. Okay, so she's having some internet issues. Okay, chicos. Um, just this is I'm going to tell you in Spanish. Eso se lo voy a decir en español, chicos. Eh, los que no han terminado sección 1 y 2 eso era para la semana pasada okay? semana pasada eh, le voy a dar hasta el día de mañana para que terminen los que no hayan terminado aún, okay? los que no hayan terminado pero si ustedes no han terminado quiero que me escriban mi whatsapp personal y me digan teacher yo soy del, del módulo número 2 su módulo número su número de módulo verdad y cuál ejercicio si no han terminado ok Y por qué no lo han terminado. Y si no tienen o algo, ok. But this must be to be finished, ok. Esto tiene que estar terminado. Section 1 and 2, ok. okay. Because for tonight, hoy, vamos a iniciar con el section number 3, ok, guys. Number 3. So, first of all, guys. Primero, let me share you something. So, I have a little game for you, okay, guys? Tengo un pequeño juego para ustedes. So, let's see. This one, guys, you are going to help me, okay? Van a ayudarme escribiendo la respuesta, okay? So, first of all, it's about occupation and professions, okay? So, let's start, okay? I have this one. I need you. Necesito que me escriban en el chat box. Type in the chat box. What is the, what is the answer? ¿Cuál es la palabra aquí, chicos, Okay. What is the word? Okay. So, okay, Sarah and Jessica, they say doctor. So let's see. Doctor. Okay. You can help me. Okay, guys, pronouncing this at home. Pueden pronunciar a su casa. Doctor. Okay, doctor. So now this one. I have this one. What is this? Tenemos dos palabras, right? Two words. So the first one, what do you think, guys? And the second one, what is this one? Okay. Help me, guys. Help me with this one. What can I say? So, let's see. What about? What do you think, guys? Hmm? What do you think? Que piensan? What is the answer for this one? No one? 
Okay, let's see. So let me help you with the first one then. So I have fire, fire, okay? Fire, you know, it's fuego, right? This is, this un bombero, right? How do you say bombero in English, guys? So you say fire, and what is this word, guys? Do you have an idea? Any idea? No? Nobody? So let's see. Then let me ask you someone. Vamos a ver palabra por palabra. So let's see. Las personas que no tienen la cámara apagada, le vamos a preguntar. Let's see. Uh, we have. Uh, let's see. Um, okay. Okay, I have an answer here. Five fired. So I say five fired. Mm, we are almost. Casi cerca. Cerca, cerca. So let's see. Vilma Jamilet, are you here with us, Vilma? Vilma? Yes. Vilma, Vilma? Yes, no? No? Are you with us? Okay. So then, um, almost, casi cerca, yeah. So guys, let's see, let me help you with this, right? So we have fire, we have F, we have I, we have G, we have D, oh, and then this one now. So we have this one, it doesn't move. Okay, so this one. So, this one goes fire fighter, okay? Fire fighter, fighter como peleador, right? Fire fighter. This one, fire fighter, perfect. I win, say fire fighter. Es bombero, okay? Bombero, fire fighter, okay? Now we have this one. So I have here, okay? So what do you, well, I have Soraya, she, she say, Guys, how do you pronounce this one, this word? I need a volunteer to tell me how to pronounce this. Let me, this one, a volunteer? Yes, volunteer, no. So guys, let me help you, okay? Necesito que practiquen en su casa esto, okay? I want to see everybody. Pilot, okay? Pilot, no pilot, no pilot, verdad? Pilot, no, pilot. Okay, pilot. Okay, pilot. Perfect. Now this one, guys. What is this? What is this? Give me your answers, guys. Give me your answers. Okay. Okay, tengo Juan, Jessica, Soraya. Yeah. So we have, chef. this is a chef. Yeah, chef. Perfect. So guys, let me also help you. Déjeme ir también con esa procesión, okay? No digamos chef, no es chef, es chef, ¿ok? Vamos a hacer el sonido, chicos. Chef. Eh, ya, yeah. el sonido como que fuera cuando le decimos a un chucho, ¿verdad? Chu, chu. ¿Ok? Hagamos el sonido. Chu, 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 chu. So, chef. ¿Ok? En sus casas, chef, ¿ok? Chef, como el ch, ¿ok? Chef. So, perfect. Now, this one, guys. What is this? Tell me, what is this? ¿Mm? Give me your answer, guys. ¿Qué creen que es esto? Okay, I have here Soraya. She said, yes, we. Yeah. Teacher. Teacher, perfect. So, the chair, right? Teacher. Perfect. And now let's see the last one. Veamos la última, chicos. Okay, so, let's... ¿qué es esto, chicos? Tell me, what is this? Okay. Let's see, what is this, guys? Okay, Soraya, Jessica, Juan, say. Policy. Okay. In this one is police, okay, police. Police. Yeah, police, just police, okay, police. Perfect, police. yeah, perfect, guys. So now, you know, let me move on. So, guys, welcome for the ones that are joining, for los que se están uniendo, chicos. Um, something that I mentioned, guys, algo que mencioné fue de que los que no han terminado section number one and two, recuerden que era para la semana pasada, ok, semana pasada, esta semana, 
eh, le voy a dar a los que no han podido terminar hasta mañana, ¿ok? Para que terminen. Si usted no ha terminado, escríbame al WhatsApp y digan, mire, no termina por esta razón y no entiendo o algo, right? Eso. But, well, guys, now let me continue some. Now, for today, class, guys, let me share you the screen. So, we are going to talk about jobs and activities, right? So, we were, you know, discussing the previous game was about jobs, right? So, now let's see what do we have for tonight, okay? So, we have, first of all, this question, okay? What do you do, okay? What do you do? What do you do, guys, is the question that you ask for people asking about what do, I mean, what is their job about, okay? What do you do, chicos? Es la pregunta que usted le hace a alguien para decirle a qué se dedica, okay? What do you do? What do you do, okay? What do you do? What do you do? Significa como a qué te dedicas, right? O qué haces, como... Por ejemplo, yo les puedo preguntar, what do you do? And you can say, I am a doctor, I am a teacher, I am a police, I am a pilot, I am a chef, okay? So what do you do? A qué te dedicas, right? So we have this one, right? What do you do? And you can answer, I am plus occupation, right? So what do you do? I am a doctor. I am a businesswoman, okay? You can say your job, right? Now you can say, I work at, you can say, I work at a hospital, I work at school, I work in an office, right? So you can answer, right? This is the place, we sorry. We okay, move on to fast. Ya los spoilé, perfect. So now you can also mention the company, right? You can say, I work for, and you say the company, organization, or person, right? I work for the government, okay? I work for the government. I work for the mayor, okay? I work for Diana, El Salvador. I work for um, Bimbo, you know? You can say that, right? The organization or the company, right? Or I work for Fulanito, right? You can say that, okay? So perfect, guys. So the question was, what do you do, right? What do you do? And you answer this, I am this, this, okay? So now let me show you. So here we have some, you know, some of the things, right? So we have, you know, these um, occupations, right? So let me show you something else, guys. Let me mostrar this. So I have here this PowerPoint for you guys. So we are going to learn new vocabulary today, okay? Vamos a aprender nuevo vocabulario el día de hoy. So we have jobs, right? Probably. You don't know some of the jobs, but let me help you, okay? So now, guys, we have this list, okay? We have many, but we are going to check some of them, right? So you see here, I have here, those, right? So now, guys, I need your help, okay? I need everybody to turn on your cameras and turn off your microphones, okay? We are going to practice, right? I want to see everybody. Vamos a practicar, chicos, okay? Cámaras encendidas, micrófonos apagados, okay? So let's start with the first one. Let's see, architect, okay? Architect, perfect. Nurse, no es nurse, no nurse, nurse, okay, nurse. We have this one, doctor, doctor. Now, hairdresser, hair, dresser okay hair dresser hair dresser okay so what is her dresser you know is the woman that cut our hair okay la mujer que corta nuestro pelo right hair dresser engineer no ingenier engineer engineer Perfect, ingeniero, right? Now, this one, waiter, waiter. Waiter is the man, okay? Es el hombre que sirve, ¿verdad? Es el hombre que sirve, es camarero, right? Camarero o mesero, right? Waiter. Now, help me with this one, guys. Police officer. Okay, I want to see everybody. Police officer. Perfect. 
Nice, guys. No tengan miedo de practicar en su casa, chicos. Okay, you are learning. Okay, que no les dé pena, right? Now we have this one. Dentist. Dentist. Tratemos de hacer el sonido al final de la T, okay? Dentist. Perfect, nice. Now this one. Postman. 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 Okay. What is postman? Yes. El cartero, right? Guys, I recommend you, les recomiendo que uh, you can uh, either take a picture or write, right? Ustedes pueden tomar luego una foto o pueden escribirlo, right? For me, in order to learn English, para aprender inglés, para mí es mejor que yo le escriba, right? porque se, se me queda más. But it's optional, right? So now this one. So this one, guys, no es electrician, es electrician, okay? Electrician, como sham, okay? Electrician, okay? Electrician, perfect. Now, mechanic, mechanic. Que no les depende abrir la boca, okay? Ustedes pueden abrirla para así estimularla, ¿verdad? Pueden estimular su boca, chicos. So, you know, let's see something, okay? Vamos a ver algo, okay? So, we are going to, you know, stimulate our mouth, okay? So I'm going to ask for the ones that are not sharing. Okay. So let's see, guys. Okay. So let's, you know, open your mouth. Abramos nuestra boca, chicos. Okay. Y movámoslo. Okay. Esta es la forma en la que vamos a estimular nuestra boca para pronunciar bien. Okay. Porque en el, en el español somos bastante arrogantes. Right. We are too lazy. Es como que no la abrimos bastante. ¿verdad? Hablamos como así. Pero en English, guys, we have to open. Tenemos que abrirlo. Okay. So. Estimule, ¿ok? No tengan pena, ¿no? Son, hasta incluso pueden mover la lengua, ¿ok? Dentro, incluso se pueden poner un lápiz si gustan, ¿verdad? Para estimularse, ¿ok? So, perfect. Now, now that we are, you know, ready, let's continue practice, ¿ok? So, we have mechanic and we have this one. Do you remember? Bombero. Firefighter. Firefighter. Perfect. Let's move on. Okay, let's continue, guys. So we have this one. So secretary. Okay. Or secretary. Okay. Secretary or secretary. Okay. Both are correct. Okay. Secretary. Okay. Secretary. Okay. Pueden pronunciar de las dos formas. Now we have this one. Lawyer. Okay. Lawyer. Salesperson. Okay, salesperson is, you know, como el vendedor, right? Vendedor. Abogado, secretaria. Bell boy. Okay. Bell boy. Es como uh, el que trabaja en el hotel, like que lleva las, las uh, maletas. Now, how do you pronounce this, guys? It's, it's not pilot, it's Pilot, okay, pilot, pilot, okay. We have astronaut, fly attendant, fly attendant, merchant, merchant, okay, carpenter, carpenter, chef, okay, chef. Actor. And the last one, this one, musician. No musician, yes, musician. Musician, musician, okay? So perfect, so perfect, guys. So now let me, you know, so how was it? You see, so those are the jobs and occupations, right? So let's, Trabajos y ocupaciones, right, guys? So now let me share you. Uh, yeah, perfect, this one. So, guys, I'm going to share you this exercise. Okay, voy a enseñarles este ejercicio. We are going to do it by um, our own. Lo vamos a hacer uno. Pero primero déjenme explicarles, okay? So, we have this question. Do you remember what do you do, right? What do you do? ¿A qué te dedicas? 
And what about if I say, what does a farmer do? What is farmer, guys? I need a volunteer to tell me what is farmer. Farmer? Farmer? You know farmer? No? Yes? Farmer? Farmer is como el granjero, right? Granjero. So I have a uh, okay. granjero, right? So what does a farmer do? ¿Qué hace un granjero? So tenemos a farmer drives people around the town, okay? A farmer writes book. A farmer grows fruit and vegetables. So guys, what do you think? Okay, I have here Daniel, Ileana, Soraya. So let's see, okay, guys, in Spanish, if you don't understand, okay? Primero, el granjero dice que conduce y lleva a las personas a la ciudad. Mm, no, right? Un granjero no hace eso. Un granjero escribe libros. No, right? Un granjero eh, siembra o hace crecer frutas y vegetales. So, that one, right? Letter C. So, perfect. Letter C, guys. Perfect. Now, guys. Ahora, chicos, it will be your turn, okay? I'm going to share you this link. Les voy a compartir este link, chicos, el link de este ejercicio aquí en el chat de Zoom, okay? In the Zoom chat. And we are going to do it, okay? Lo vamos a hacer cada, bueno, cada uno lo va a hacer separado, okay? Una vez que lo termine, solo son seis, okay, chicos? Una vez que se termine, pueden mandar su respuesta al grupo de WhatsApp, okay? También les voy a mandar el link al grupo de WhatsApp por si eh, no pueden copiarlo aquí, ¿verdad? Pero ya está el link, ya pueden ingresar, chicos. We are going to start working, okay? At 8.25, it must be finished. A las 8.25 ya debe estar terminado. Vamos a realizarlo. Una vez realizado al final, le va a tirar cuántos se sacaron. Le va a dar el score. And you have to send it, okay? You have to send it to the WhatsApp group. Tienen que mandarlo después al grupo de WhatsApp, okay? So now let me share you... You can copy the link, guys. It's already on Zoom, okay? So we have time, okay? Let's see. Okay. Let me share you. Okay, so this... Uh, no puedo ingresar Carlos Dominguez. Carlos Dominguez is here. Yeah, oh yeah, he's here. Yeah, so... I saw your message, so... Okay, perfect. Um... So let's see, guys. Um, whenever you finish the exercise, you can send it, okay? Cuando terminen, puede terminar. If you have any question about the exercise, you can ask. Okay? Si tienen alguna pregunta del ejercicio, pueden enviarla. Les voy a mandar también el link a WhatsApp para los que no han podido ingresar. So you can go there, okay? So perfect. Nice, guys. So we have time, right? We have four minutes to finish the exercise. Okay, let's see. Okay, perfect. So for the ones that are joining, for para los que se han unido recientemente, chicos, si ya terminaron, recuerden que la sección 1 y 2 tiene que estar terminada, okay? Sección 1 y 2 must be finished. Si no han terminado, les voy a estar mañana, pero necesito que me escriban al WhatsApp, okay? Que me escriban al WhatsApp porque no han terminado y qué les falta, okay? So, perfect. So we have some scores. So we have from Daniel, five or six, nice. And what, who is the next person? Okay, six of six, perfect, guys. So, uno de ustedes ya terminaron, chicos. So, come on, you can do it, okay? Let me show you the screen. Okay, come on, guys, I know you can do it. Let me, okay, here I have it, okay. Here it is, okay. So what does a writer do, guys? We have this one. What does a cook do, okay. Let's look, what does a mechanic do? What does an actor do, okay. What does a shop assistant do? So let me tell you guys in Spanish if you don't know, okay. What does a writer do? A writer. So a writer es un escritor, okay? ¿Qué hace un escritor? What does a writer do? Ok, 
Okay, ¿qué hace un escritor? What does a cook do? Cook, guys, es un chef, ¿ok? Es un chef, es lo mismo, es un cocinero, ¿ok? What does a mechanic do? Un mecánico, ¿qué hace un mecánico? What does an actor do? ¿Qué hace un actor? And what does a shop assistant do? ¿Qué hace un asistente de compras? ¿Ok? So, let's see, guys. ¿Ok? Let's see how many of you have sent. Uh, ok. Perfect. Come on, guys. I need everybody to send me your answers. ¿Ok? Necesito que todos me envíen sus respuestas. ¿Ok? Come on. Ok. Perfect. I have Efraín. Nice, perfect. Okay, we have just one minute, guys. Carlos, nice. Iliana, perfect. What about the rest, guys? I'm taking notes, okay? I'm taking notes. Estoy tomando notas que nos están mandando, okay? So, come on, guys. So, let me show you. Okay, so... Where I have Josman, Eric. Nice, guys. Perfect, Mary. Nice. Okay, perfect, guys. So we have this exercise. Okay, so now let me, you know, help me with this. Well, help me with this one, okay, guys. So what does a writer do? ¿Qué hace un escritor? A writer reads book. Él lee libros. A writer writes books. Él escribe libros. Or a writer cooks. Cocina. ¿Qué creen? So... It's a writer, right? So he writes. So él escribe, right? Perfect. Yes, I have it here. Daniel B. Yeah, nice guys. Perfect. Now let's move on to this one. What does a cook do? A cook, ya les dije, es un chef, right? Es un cocinero. So a cook's work at home, trabaja en casa. Probably, yeah, probably. A cook writes book, escribe libros, un cocinero. Yeah, some of them, yes, but... Let's see. Un cocinero prepares food in a restaurant. Prepara comida en un restaurante, right? So I have here Daniel and Carlos also. Yes, because I see. Yeah. Food, right? They prepare food. Now, let's see. What does a mechanic do? Okay. A mechanic repairs cars. Repara carros. Okay. Un mecánico works in a restaurant. Trabaja en un restaurante. No, right? A mechanic cleans homes and office. Un mecánico limpia casas y oficinas. No, right? So in this case, it's letter A. Yeah, perfect, guys. The one Daniel, Liana, Jessica, yes. Repairs cars. Perfect. Now let's see. What does an actor do? Que hace un actor, right? So he plays in films. Él actúa en películas. He writes books. Él escribe libros. He works in a shop. Él trabaja en una tienda. So, is the first one, right? He plays in a field. Plays. Perfect. And let's see the last one. What does a shop assistant do? ¿Qué hace un asistente de compras? So, a shop assistant buys things in a shop. Compra cosas en una tienda. Okay. A shop assistant sells things in a shop. Vende cosas en una tienda. O a shop assistant helps six people. O ayuda a las personas enfermas. So what is the answer, guys? Let's see. So I have Jessica say B. Uh, what about the rest, guys? Okay. What does a shop assistant do? Okay, let's see. Letter B, also Daniel. What about the rest? Give me your answer, guys. Let's see. A shop assistant. Okay, I see some of you have sent the exercise. Okay, I would say B, Osman B. Okay, so, un asistente de compra vende, co buen, well, sell things, vende pensamientos en una tienda. So, this one, right? So, perfect. So, probablemente, chicos, uno de ustedes quizás no... La última quizás es un poco complicada, and that's okay, because we are learning, ¿ok? Y está bien porque estamos aprendiendo, ¿ok? Así que no se sienta mal si ya se le salió mal o no, ¿ok? We are learning. So perfect. Now, let me move on, guys, ¿ok? 
Let me see, okay? So we have this one, right? A cashier, okay? So we have these other, you know, uh, occupations, right? So let's find, okay? So we have this vocabulary. Tenemos este vocabulario, chicos. And let's start, okay? Here you are going to help me, okay? Aquí me van a ayudar todos, okay? So let's start with the first one. Guys. We have cashier. You can see here, letter A. Um, a, verdad? Cashier, cashier. So cashier, let's find a cashier, okay, aquí. So it's, está en la primera, first, second, third, fourth, fifth, or sixth. ¿En cuál imagen está un cashier, chicos? Cashier. I need you to type your answer. Okay? Necesito que escriban su respuesta. En one, two, three, four, five, six. ¿En cuál imagen, chicos? Let's see. Okay, Jessica says six. Okay, let's see. Cashier. Image number six. And the picture number six. Okay. Okay, Juan Carlos says six. Ileana says uno. Number one. And six, Daniel six. Okay, so let's find, okay? So a cashier. Let's start uh, asking some of you. Vamos a preguntarle a alguno de ustedes. Vamos a ver. Um, well, first of all, I need you, bueno, a volunteer. A volunteer to tell me what is a cashier in Spanish. What is a cashier? I need a volunteer to tell me. Cashier? Cashier? No? Un cajero. Okay, thank you, Juan. Yeah, cashier es un cajero, okay? Perfect, thank you. So, we have here, right? Cashier, do you see? Está aquí, right? In the image number six, cashier. Perfect. Now, let's find, you know, uh, let's see. So, let's move on and look for a waiter. Aquí, waiter, waiter. So, we have seen waiter. And what... Image is the waiter. One, two, three, four, five, six. A waiter, guys. Waiter. Okay. Jessica, Daniel say five. Jessica say four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So I say five. Okay. So now I want to, well, I need a, another volunteer to tell me. What is a waiter? Get some waiter, guys. A volunteer. I need a volunteer. Okay. Waiter. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Well, I, I could hear it. Thank you, Sarah and Daniel. Waiter is un mesero, right? Waiter. Perfect. So we have here, right? Waiter. Pero, but but mm -hmm. for woman is white. Waiters. Yes, perfect. Thank you, Sarah. Yes. So, chicos, tenemos que waiter es mesero, right? But for woman, o para mujeres, for girls, eh, se dice waitress, okay? El que está aquí abajo, waitress, okay? Solo para mujeres, para hombres es waiter, okay? Waiter, waitress, okay? So, you see, easy, right? So, well, now, guys, I need to, well, I need your help now. Probably some of you know this vocabulary. Algunos de ustedes ya conocen este vocabulario y ya lo saben, right? But I need you, necesito que busquen cuál es la palabra que no entiendo, okay? ¿Cuál es de estas profesiones ustedes no saben qué es? I need you to uh, look for it. Necesito que lo busquen y lo escriban en el chat, okay? Yo sé que todos debemos, aquí deben de tener una que no, no saben qué es, right? O si no tienen dos o tres, necesito que me escriban en el chat, okay? Escriben en el chat cuál de estas profesiones no entienden, no saben qué significa. O so, tenemos a cashier, tenemos the cook, chef, doctor, flight attendant, judge, lawyer, musician, nurse, pilot, police office, uh, receptionist, uh, salesperson, ¿qué más tenemos? Security ward. So, come on. Okay, so let's see. Let's start. We have uh, Maritza. She say E, okay, letter E. Judge, okay, judge Marisa es el juez, okay? Judge es un juez, okay? Letter A, okay? 
letter, sorry, letter E, la letra E, judge, es un juez. Now we have a Daniel. Daniel say D. Let's see D. Fly attendant. So fly attendant es una sobrecargo. Okay? Fly attendant. Fly attendant. Fly de vuelo. Attendant, attendant, right? Es una sobrecargo. Fly attendant. And letter N. Letter N. Singer. Singer es un cantante. Singer. Let's see. Uh, salesperson. Salesperson, letra JKL. Salesperson es un vendedor, ¿ok? Es un vendedor. Guys, if you don't know it, please write it. Si no saben, pues escríbanlo para que se les quede, right? Ok, singer, singer, cantante. Judge, judge es un juez. Uh, waitress, waitress es mesera, right? Waitress. Doctor, well, doctor es doctor. <laughs> ok, perfect. Doctor, firefighter, firefighter. Uh, firefighter es un bombero, right? Bueno, aquí no está el firefighter, pero es eso, right? Firefighter es un bombero. Pilot, okay. Piloto, teacher, maestro, police, policía. Okay. Perfect. So, now it's guys. Perfect. So now, let's see. Waiter is, um, Mesero, right? So perfect, guys. Uh, now let's see. Let's move on, okay, guys? So now let me explain you this. Let me explain you this. Tenemos place to work, right? Teníamos las profesiones, si ahora los lugares de trabajo, right? Place to work. So we have in a hospital, okay? Repeat, in a hospital. Hospital, okay? In an office. In an office. In an office, okay? In a store, en una tienda, right? In a store, in a hotel, okay? In a hotel. So place to work, right? Lugares donde se trabaja, okay? So you can take notes of this one, guys, if you want, okay? Pueden tomar notas, screenshot, or whatever thing, okay? Now, let me explain you this one. Esto es algo extra que les voy a enseñar, chicos. Okay, this is extra. Just if you don't know it, okay? Solo si no lo saben. So, cuando ocupar a and an, okay? The differences, okay? A and an. So, we have a, right? A, when the next word starts with a consonant sound. Cuando la siguiente palabra inicia con una letra consonante, okay? Ocupamos a. Por ejemplo, a book, okay? Book, you see? It's a B, right? Es una consonante. Consonante, chicos, son todas las palabras, todas las letras que no son vocales, okay? A book, a book, a car, a dog, a frog. So you see? Consonant, right? Ahí es cuando ocupamos A. Y A significa un, una, right? Ahora vamos con an. Um, it says that we use it after, you know, a word that starts with a bubble sound, bubble sound, un sonido de vocal. So tenemos an apple, a, okay, ah, es un sonido de vocal, apple, an egg, an insect, an o, okay, orange, okay. So let's see these examples. Si miren este ejemplo, right? Aquí tenemos in an office. ¿Por qué? Ocupamos an porque este sonido era, vo era vocal, right? Era vocal, ¿ok? Aquí en las demás ocupamos a porque el sonido no es vocal, ¿ok? Aquí es ho hotel, es store, hospital. But let's focus on this, ¿ok? Es sonido, ¿ok? So, for example, eh, tenemos estos sonidos que aunque inici no inician con vocal suena como vocal. Por ejemplo, esto, chicos. Esto no se pronuncia hour, right? Esto, ni hour, se pronuncia hour, ok? Hour. So you see, a es el sonido de la vocal, right? An hour. Por eso ocupamos an. En esta, chicos, ocupamos, incluso aunque inicie con vocal, el sonido, it says the you at the beginning, of university sounds like you, okay? Suena como un you, a university. So that's why 
¿ok? Es el sonido, ¿ok? Si el sonido de la palabra es consonante, le agregamos A. Pero si el sonido de la palabra es vocal, el sonido, ocupamos AN, ¿ok? So, AN OFFICE, A STORE, ¿ok? Got it, guys? Any questions so far? Una pregunta hasta aquí. Yes, no, pregunta, queja, demanda, no. Ok, perfect. So, do not worry, guys. I'm going to send you, le voy a mandar, como siempre saben, las diapositivas so you can take it, ok? Pueden tomar nota de esto. So, now, guys, we have some activities here, ok? So, let's see. Where's a uniform, ok? Where's a uniform? ¿Se dan cuenta? A, aquí el sonido es U, como de tú, ¿verdad? U. Uniform, ok? Repeat. Uniform. Ok, no uniform. Es uniform. Where's a uniform? Where's a uniform means that you put on the, the uniform, right? Que es piste un uniforme, right? In some jobs, they use the words uniform, right? Con los trabajos, o sea, you piste un uniforme. Sits all day. Repeat, guys. Sits all day. Ok. Muchos permanecen sentados todo el día, right? Sits all day. Talks to people, okay? Or talk to people means, you know, when you, your job is, you know, to talk with people, right? That you talk to people all the day, right? Works hard, trabaja duro. Stands all day, okay? Parado todo el día. Handles money, handles money, you know, like a cashier que manejan dinero, right? Handles money. Works at night. Works at night, okay? Trabajan de noche, okay? Well, I guess you don't work at night because you're here, right? Están no trabajan de noche porque están aquí, right? So, now let me, you know, show you something before you continue. So, in this one, let's see. Let's take an example about place to work, okay? So, we can say, guys, uh, Let's see, a doctor works in a hospital, right? That's right, right? Un doctor trabaja en un hospital, right? A doctor works in a hospital. So you can notice the S, right? Recordamos la tercera persona, he, she, and it, le agregamos la S al verbo, right? He works. Now give me, díganme a alguien que trabaja en una oficina. Give me a... Secretary. 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 Yeah. Uh, Thank you. So let's see. Uh, uh, secretary works in an office, right? Trabaja en una oficina, right? And things like that. Now in a store. Who works in a store, guys? ¿Quién trabaja en una tienda? Salesman. Salesman. A sell... A sales man works in a store, right? So perfect. Now let's see. We have these activities, right? Where's a uniform? Get a vestir un uniforme, right? Sits all day, sentado todo el día, talk to people, right? So now, guys, we have this question, okay? This will be a conversation and activity for tonight, okay? Esto lo vamos a practicar hoy con sus compañeros, okay? So we have the first question. What do you do? You know what is that, right? What do you do? A qué te dedicas, right? And what does your sister or brother do, right? A qué se dedica tu hermano, hermana? Where do you work? Where do you study? Do you like your job, okay? I'm going to send you, les voy a mandar estas preguntas al grupo. O si ustedes quieren, pueden tomarle una foto aquí, right? Una foto, or you can take it, right? I'm going to divide the class, okay? Voy a dividirlos en breakout rooms, guys. So vemos 20. So let's see how many. Uh, let's see. Seven, right? Let's see. So I'm going to divide you into groups, guys. So you can practice, okay? Pueden practicar con sus compañeros, okay? So let's see. You can accept it now, guys. Pueden aceptar. Um, so you can start practicing, okay? 
Vamos a practicar estas preguntas, ¿okay? Van a practicar estas preguntas con sus compañeros, ¿okay? Se van a estar preguntando y respondiendo, ¿okay? So, I have sent you guys the picture. Ya les mandé la picture de las preguntas al grupo de WhatsApp o pueden tomar una foto si ustedes gustan aquí, right? So, come on, guys. If you can accept it, please. Okay, nice. Very nice. Okay, so who do we have here? Uh, Carlos, if you can accept that. Ileana, please. Uh, Jessica, Carlos, Osman, Vilma, Ileana, I don't know if you can accept that. Uh, Jessica, um, can you accept the request, please? Okay, nice. Perfect. Uh, Jessica, you cannot... No puedes aceptar, Jessica. Oh, there is something wrong. No, no me sale. <laughs> really? Okay, let me see. Déjame entonces moverte. Let me see. I'm going to move it for number one. Let's see. Okay, I will see. Okay, perfect. Okay. Okay, Eric. Well, I think this is not Eric. Screen. So let's see the participants. Is there work in a shop? Or uh huh. That in is shop. the answer. My sister work in a shop. Sí, creo que sí. Okay. No. Y sería la ¿Quién okay. va a empezar a primero a preguntar? Okay, for example, uh, Nubia, mm -hmm. where, where do you work? Oh. Yes, yes, I like you, Hub. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Ahora. Where do you work? Okay. Where do you study? Do you like your job? I uh, and Torrefactora La Majada. Okay. Uh, yes. Where do you study? Um, I study in University UCA. <laughs> the UCA University. Good. Do you like your work? Uh, yes, I like my work. I drink all coffee today. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> That's great. Sounds great. You love your work. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes.
<laughs> okay, so welcome back, everybody. Welcome. Well, your classmates are joining now. So perfect, guys. I hope you have practiced, but okay, I'm practical, all right? Because now I'm going to show us, I have four, five rooms. Okay, tenía cinco rooms. Voy a escoger una persona de cada room, okay? So let's start with the room number one. I'm going to choose Edwin. Edwin, are you here? Yes. So perfect, Edwin. And let's start. Let me ask you, you know, the first, well, this question. What do you do? So in my job, I do many things. So I work in an office. Okay, you work in an office. So you can say, first of all, uh, are you um, like someone that works in an office? What is your profession? And si sería como... Um, my professional is uh, Bachelor of Fitness Administration. Okay, bachelor, bachelor. You can say I am a bachelor, a bachelor. And you can say I work in an office, right? This one. Perfect. Thank you, Edwin. Now, let's see. Let's, uh, for the room number two, I have uh, Ileana. Ileana, hello. Hi, good night, Ileana. So let me ask you this question, okay? What does your sister or brother do? ¿Qué se dedica tu hermano o tu hermana? So tell me. Mm, my sister in... is... ¿Qué significa trabaja? She works. Ella trabaja. And she works. Uh, but what does she do? A que se dedica? A que se? Is a secretary? Is a um, account? Is a teacher? What is? Okay. So my sister is a lawyer. Okay, it's a lawyer. lawyer. She lawyer. works in an office, right? Puede ser una oficina también. So mm -hmm. perfect. So thank you, Liana. Thank you very much. So now let's move on for room number three. But uh, number three, I have a uh, Eulise. So Eulise, are you here with us? Hello, Eulise. Hola, hola. Hi, hello. So I'm going to ask you this question, Eulise. So where do you work? Where do you work? Yeah. Um, I work in textile and there i am i am a mechanic and you're a mechanic i okay. am a mechanic yeah you can say i am a mechanic i am a mechanic and i work y trabajo in you say tech right tech but tech something yeah <laughs> so nice perfect thank you and then we have for room number four a uh, Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos, hello, good night. Hello, good night. Hi, so Juan Carlos, now I have this question for you. So where do you study? Oh, okay. Uh I not study. Okay, you can say I don't or I don't know. I don't study. study, perfect. But I work because porque trabajas, right? But I work. Uh, uh, but um, I'm a mechanic. But I work. I am a mechanic. Mechanic. Perfect. <laughs> okay, and where? That's nice. Okay. So oh. thank you. Yeah, thank you, Juan Carlos. Very nice. Congrats. So okay. Thank you for your participation. And now I have the last participant for today. So for room number five, I have Dan Tom. I have Irving. So Irving, hello. Hello. Hi, Irving. Good night. 
So right. tell me, the last question is for you. So do you like your job? Uh, yes, why not? <laughs> okay, you can say, yes, I do. Yeah. And what do you do, Irvin? What do you do? Oh, I am a digitizer. Digitize, you are a, a digitizer. I, so, I, yes. What, what do you do? I your make job? production hmm? controls. I make production controls uh, by orders, something like this. Okay. Digitizer. Well, I will say digi digital man can be, right? I am a digital man and I work in, and you say your, the name of the company, right? The name of the company. Bali. Bali. Yeah. Okay, I work in Bali. Perfect. So, well, guys, that's, you know, how much we can do, do right? Como podemos... Más que todo el decir dónde trabajamos y qué hacemos, right? Now, guys, well, we are almost finished and ya estamos terminando. Due to the time, guys. Uh, well, I have this exercise, but we are not going to finish today. No lo vamos a lograr terminar. But let me share you the screen, okay? Déjenme compartir la pantalla, chicos, okay? So this is I'm going, this I'm going to tell you in Spanish, okay? Se lo puedo decir en español. Tenemos este ejercicio, chicos. Estamos en la session three, okay? The section three, guys, we have this, right? So, for example, what is his job? De que su trabajo? He is a receptionist. So, can you see it? Now, what's her job? ¿Cuál es su trabajo de ella, right? Her, su de ella. So, she's a doctor. Podemos ver aquí, right? Number two. What's her job? She's a nurse, right? Now, we have this one. What's his job? He is... De él, ¿verdad? What's his job? So, he is, he's a kid, chicos. He's a pilot. pilot. Right? Yeah, he's a pilot, right? Or podemos decir he is, right? He's a pilot, right? Now, what's her, su, right, trabajo? So, she's a fly. Attendant, right? So fly attendant. Es una sobrecarga. So, and we have the rest, okay? Tenemos la siguiente, chicos, okay? What his and her, okay? Recordemos his es de él, right? Her, de ella, right? What his job, que es él? His, a musician. Yes, yes. Perfect. Now, what's her job, okay? She's a singer, okay? Recordemos his and her, okay? His and her. Y si tenemos el resto, ¿verdad? Tenemos estos demás. Si usted tiene alguna pregunta, alguna duda, you can type me, ¿ok? Pueden escribir. Yo tengo una pregunta. Yes. Eh, respecto a las, a las, a los, digamos, a los ejercicios que están dando en esta página que acaba de mostrar, pero en la siguiente, donde están todos los ejercicios, puede mostrarla, uh, por favor. Yeah, this one. Acá, acá donde están todos estos ejercicios, uno tiene que llenarlos, ¿no? Ah, Sí, todos tienen que llenarlos. Ya la sección 1 y 2 ya la debemos haber terminado. ¿verdad? Esta ya es la sección 3. Si no la han terminado, pueden escribirme en WhatsApp, ¿ok, chicos? Decirme cuál no han terminado y por qué, right? Y we can see, right? Um, bueno, para tarea, chicos, solo vamos a realizar esta, ¿ok? Solo esta, ¿ok? ¿Qué es la primera? ¿Qué es esto, right? This one. What's his job, ¿ok? Vamos a terminar esta. Mañana igual vamos a estar revisando por si usted no logró terminarla o no logró entenderla, ¿ok? So, mañana la vamos a estar terminando y la vamos a estar haciendo, right Pero eh, si les queda tarea, right Que la hagan si saben, eh, si sienten que sí la pueden hacer, ¿ok? And we are going, you know, to see the next classes. Ustedes si quieren pueden ver estos videos, chicos, right This one, no sé, well, pueden ver estos. Pero de tarea solo es esto, ¿ok? El primero, right So... Perfect, guys. So now, well, this was everything for today. Esto fue todo por hoy, chicos. So it was, you know, nice to see you today. Okay, fue bastante bueno verlos. So see you tomorrow, okay? Nos vemos mañana and have a good night. So see you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Take care, guys. Bye-bye. 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 Bye. 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 Bye.